In this the summer of staycations, we are looking at a number of day trips that people could take on their bicycles to some interesting villages and places around our town. The first is going to be a loop cycle of about an hour and 40 minutes to Kilconnell, the small village in the northwest of Banlaslow. We're going to go out the R348 road, which uh, goes out Sarsfield Road. You continue straight on on the R348 through Nutfield Cross which Councillor Dermot Connolly got a pile of money for to do a reorientation of the junction. And there's no um, mountains or there's no hills on this particular cycle. You should make it out to Kilconnell village in about uh, 35 minutes. It's 15 kilometres out. It's a small rural village. Uh, it gives its name to the Barony of Kilconnell, famous for the Abbey, the Franciscan Priory. The lands were formerly held by Lords de Frain, and there's also a peerage title, Baron Kilconnell, dated 1797. Uh, which was also a subsidiary title of the Earls of Carty. Um, the beating heart of the village is uh, Tim Broderick's, Councillor Tim's Bar, Broderick's Bar, which does food during the, the evenings and uh, serves a nice pint, uh, famous also for its Donlan Cross. Now, the Abbey, the Franciscan Friar, um, the, it founded in the O'Kelly's territory, uh, which were the Lords of Omonia, and uh, it is one of the most extens extensive examples of medieval architecture in our um, area. The, the transept, the chancery, and all uh, the existing carvings are original. They're not remodelled. And uh, there's a huge uh, history of the abbey from the 14th century right up to the present day. It was evacuated. Uh, it, it did rather well through Cromwellian times. It was evacuated in about 1785, and the monks retired to the nearby Lacocalla. The Community Development Association have been busy developing the village and there is a wonderful spot for a picnic in the community park uh, which has a 1.2 kilometre forest trail for those whose legs aren't already tired. You could pull in there and have a nice picnic uh, uh, to break the journey back to Banlaslow if you don't want to break it at the lake. So uh, they have a wonderful facility uh, that they developed their community pitch uh, across the road from the St. Gabriel's uh, GEA uh, pitch, which is, a, a, again, another vibrant uh, element of uh, the community of Kilconnell. And then swinging north, northwest of the town, uh, along uh, the road from the Donlan uh, Cross, um, you arrive to Callow Lock, uh, which is a little known, uh, wonderful gem of a water uh, feature. Um, the Development Association again uh, received a grant to create a host of fishing positions uh, for disabled users, which is quite unique uh, to our locality. It's a nice spot. It's well stocked with uh, rainbow trout by the Irish Fisheries Board. Uh, permits and licences and all that can be got from Timmy's. And on the cycle back, you go, you follow back in the road to the Fohana Cross, take the left at Fohana, and you come at, at the back roads uh, back to the Mena Haska Road. You turn right uh, to the St. Kildur Church Yard and then you make a left to take you back in uh, another road to Banlaslow, which is in the Deer Park Road. And that will take you past um, the wonderful ruins of Kilcluny Church, then up to, again, uh, the next gate lodge uh, on that road. And you make a left and that swings you back into the town uh, through through the, um, the Sarsfield Road. So our next vacation tours will be to... Uh, Channel Bridge and to Clontuskert and to Ockram and we hope you enjoy doing them.